Yeah. Liam, just how do you assess the energy level first time getting back out here after winter workouts? How'd that feel for you guys? Um, I mean, I always love it. Um, it's always good to be back out here and playing football. You, you, you do all these workouts for a, a good couple months and then you kind of miss football for a little. So um, it's a nice break, but I mean, it's good to be, get out here and get things going again. The O-line specifically, did you get the sense that you guys are just kind of chomping at the bit following spring break just to get everything started again? Oh uh, yeah, just, yeah, just doing drills, lifting, and uh, just a bunch of the little things that we have to do all over the off season to get stronger and faster and uh, just be more physical. Um, but yeah, I mean, all, all, all five of us, even the whole whole group inside the, the meeting room today was just wanting to get out there and just play. We want the pads on already, so. For, for your position group, what do you want to get done this spring? Um, I want to be the most cohesive group we can be on the field, and I want to uh, be, be the starting point for the whole team. We want to, we want to set the tone, and uh, we want to get the games going. Like, if we get the coin flip, we want, we want the ball. We want to go, and we want to attack them on, uh, on the go. You were a vocal player last year too. With Andre being gone now, do you feel like you have a responsibility to be more of a, even more of a leader on this offensive line too? Um, I, I've always felt like that my whole life. I'm, I've always felt like uh, uh, you, you, there's always something that can be better and something that can be uh, like approved upon. And um, I mean, if, if no one's gonna say it, then shoot, I'll say it. Like I'm not afraid to say say anything. So. I'll, I'll get my, my words out and however it comes out. Kingston and Beresford gained a ton of weight this winter, a lot of muscle. Just what have you seen from them and workouts and how they look out there today? Oh, they're they're way more improved than, than I have been. Uh, even like my class has, has even said that um, we're really proud of them and uh, they just got to put it all into pieces now. Like you got your shot, it's, go put it into uh, place now. You did a little bit of work at left tackle there toward the end of reps. Are you comfortable playing either spot, or would you prefer to stay at left guard or play one way or the other? I'll play anything. Uh, it puts me at center, I'll play center. Um, whatever he needs to be done, I'll play it. And I, I want to be the most versatile I can be. Is there, a, is there a particular point of emphasis in year two under Coach Miller now that you're accustomed to his system, his style? Um, yeah, I mean, we've gotten a lot closer to Coach Miller. Um, we like what he's done over this past year. I mean, we've kind of set our set the tone with being the top ten line, uh, linemen. So we want to we want to be number one next year. We don't want to be in the top ten. What was your reaction this winter when you found out that Rob was going to get that sixth year and he was going to be able to come back? Uh, Rob's been close with us uh, the whole three years he's been here, three or four years. So uh, I mean, we, we've gotten really close and uh, just glad to have another uh, older guy come back because we, we we got some young guys that. Uh, can, can use some help right now. There's only so much you can say, but with Gage and Jameer being sidelined, just what can you do as an offensive line as a team to support them through their rehab? Um, yeah, that's it's it's tough. I mean, a, a lot of people get hurt, but um, it's just about picking them back up and uh, keeping them going. Uh, make sure they get into the rehab and stuff. And um, I mean, I haven't seen Gage play too much. I saw him play against us, but uh, I know Jameer's a great player, so um, I'm excited to see both of them get back out there and. Uh, Get ready to play in the fall. Uh, Little half. Oh, go ahead. What personal goals do you have for yourself this spring? For myself, be the best player I can be uh, every day. Um, be the most physical, physically dominant. I want to be dominant on the field. I want to make sure people know like that I'm here. And um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be the leader. I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna, I'm gonna scream, shout. You, you can you probably hear me on the field, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out there and just have a, a, a good time uh, every day. Little off topic, but timely. Did you feel out a March Madness bracket, and who are you taking to win it all this year? No, I haven't filled out a March Madness bracket, but uh, I've been watching Duke basketball since I was in the boxers with my grandpa. So I'm going for Duke, and hopefully Zion uh, has some good games. There you go.